How about this little known fact? The city of Danville and Fox 56 are connected by history. Just consider our call letters, W, D, K, Y. That's your first clue. We have those call letters because the man who purchased the license for the station when it first came about in the mid 1980s lived two counties away in Russell County and he thought it'd be a good to have a station licensed in Danville. But the station transmitter is actually in Garrett County. Sadly, financing fell through so that man never got on the air with our station. That didn't happen until he sold the license to John Bakke. For more of this history lesson, let's bring in Matt Hall, who's been a Fox 56 employee for more than three decades. The only thing that was ever in Danville was a, a business office. And the, so the FCC regulations at the time were your transmitter site, your tower had to be within so many miles of the licensed city. Technically, Danville still is the licensed city, so WDKY, Danville, Kentucky, is where, uh, where they came up with the WDKY. <laughs> I love the story, and how about this? Matt Hall was there on day one when the transmitter was installed in Garrett County. He tells me the transmitter was used and it came from channel 57 in Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. In fact, obviously transmitters big, they had to break it down and then take pictures with a 35 millimeter camera and send those pictures along with the pieces from the transmitter so Matt and his colleagues could figure out how to piece it together and install it in Garrett County. We're sure glad they figured it out.